I'm Shemane Krupp and I would like to welcome you at my exhibition Rehearsal at Axel Vervoort Gallery at Canal. Rehearsal is an important concept for me. It comes from theatre, where I started out as an artist. The moment of rehearsal was always to observe where things were still changing and in process and questions. Everything is subject to change. You enter rehearsal by the patio. Patio is known for the big white cube working with daylight. I made an intervention where I faded out the patio into a shadow. The portal in itself is a sculpture, an architectural intervention, but it can be also played. When it resonates, it fills the whole space. It's also introducing, for me, experiencing art is that mental process. I love to involve the viewer to realize that they also almost become the author of the work, the activator of the work. Maybe also are the work, because from the moment you look into a work, you become it. Next to the main room is a smaller room where you have, I call them sonic paintings. These resonant pieces are represented in frames, ratios, that are referring to film screens. You look at something visual, but it also becomes a resonant object when it's activated. When you don't activate them and you look at them, still the resonance is present because the memory of the sound is always in these pieces. I'm interested in art that has no borders, that is like melting into another reality, another physical reality, but also other mental realities. In my work, I've been always researching the idea of the abstract, the monochrome, and how the abstract and the monochrome become a surface in which we project. When we move up to the terrace, there are two pieces inspired by the concert, a painting uh, from Vermeer that has been stolen from the Isabella Stewart Gardner Museum in Boston. I was fascinated by the idea of such an iconic painting and how it still resonates also in our memory. I reduced the concert to these geometric shapes that are the visual lines, the compositions from the painting, diagonal, vertical, horizontal, and you look at a kind of after image shifting from a positive to a negative. Is it the representation of the actual painting or is there original, a projection that is in your mind? After image is projected on the back wall of the big space at the terrace. It's directly projected on the wall. It also therefore shows the location in itself as a canvas. I always address the spaces that I'm working in as a part of the work. I call light a blanket that covers everything. It doesn't select. It's a very including medium. And it also always melts with what is there. It embraces the surrounding, everything that enters into it. <laughs> 